Well, more lawmakers are calling for Governor Cuomo to step down amid another scandal, but most New York voters don't agree. Now, according to a new Siena College poll, 50% say he should not immediately resign, 35% say he should, and many think that he can continue to effectively do his job despite the investigation. CBS News' John Diaz with more. Another day, another call from Mayor Bill de Blasio demanding Governor Andrew Cuomo resign. The governor's in crisis, and his crisis has become a distraction to the whole state. Seven women have accused Cuomo of sexual harassment and or inappropriate behavior, which he denies. The mayor saying he hasn't personally talked to the governor in weeks, and now pointing to new claims that one of Cuomo's top advisors and vaccine czar, Larry Schwartz, may have crossed ethical lines. What we've heard is about the governor and his team trying to link vaccine supply to political support. That is the definition of corruption. Uh, it is disgusting. It is dangerous. Uh, there are lives on the line, and it cannot be tolerated. There needs to be now a full investigation of that. A report in the Washington Post details the claims that Schwartz made calls to county executives, questioning their loyalty for the governor. He better not call me, because I'll tell him what he can do with that. The report was co-written by investigative reporter Amy Britton. Asking things like, you know, are you willing to say uh, that that uh, we should wait to see the results of the attorney general investigation? Schwartz is heading up New York's COVID-19 vaccine rollout. He admitted to the calls to gauge political support, but said they were separate from his role in the vaccination effort, and he, quote, did nothing wrong. He added he made the calls on his own, not the direction of the governor. They were wondering, you know, what if I give the wrong answer? Is the vaccine supply from my county going to be affected? Meanwhile, over the weekend, both U.S. Senators for New York, Chuck Schumer and Kirsten Gillibrand, continuing their call for a resignation. Both President Joe Biden and Speaker of the House Nancy Pelosi, though, are stopping short of calling on Cuomo to resign. Instead, waiting for the outcome of the Attorney General investigation. Pelosi saying, though, on ABC's This Week, the governor should look inside his heart. He loves New York to see if, uh, if he can govern effectively. And the attorney general investigation could take up to a few months to complete. From the east side, John Diaz, CBS 2 News. Uh, to